Welcome to Epic Stock Due Diligence. Please subscribe at youtube.com forward slash Epic Stock DD. Thank you. Hey y'all, welcome back to another exciting episode of Epic Stock Due Diligence. Now if you haven't subscribed already, I encourage you to do so. It's youtube.com forward slash Epic Stock DD. Now what I want to talk about today is ignoring the buzz and questioning what's next. And I'm going to illustrate a very, um, a very specific example here. So most of us are familiar with the dot-com boom. When all of these fly-by-night internet companies went from pennies to dollars to many multimillionaires, many new multimillionaires were made overnight because of the dot-com boom. But what a lot of people say, they'll look back and they'll say, oh, coulda, shoulda. And then they may say, well, the next dot com is medical marijuana or recreational marijuana. People get so caught up in the buzz and they look at what's hot, what's hot on the street that day. And not that that's a problem because as a momentum player, the momentum is where the buzz is. And that's not a problem. But if one wants something greater they're the person that gets in before everybody else does so the people that identified the up-and-coming dot-com stocks before anyone even really knew what a computer was those are the people if they invested that likely created a stress-free life uh, for themselves for for eternity because they were able to likely make a lot of money and not have to worry about it again. The momentum traders, there's a lot of money to be made there. And also there's a lot of money to be lost. But the people that really sit around and they do their due diligence and they say, you know, I'm going to identify something. I'm going to identify a sector, an up and coming sector that people have not yet even thought about. Not just traders, but people in general. I mean, what if I told you that tomorrow that, that hoverboards will become a reality? I mean, this is a ridiculous example. But what if I told you tomorrow that, that we would no longer drive cars, that we would have some sort of other transportation vehicle? Who knows? But it's one of those things, if you do your, if you do your research... And you, I mean, some things are not as easy to predict. But if you look at, if you look at history, and let's look at television, for example. So TV evolved from not only black and white, but, and not only just delivered by way of rabbit ears, but then we got that cable plugged into the house and you were able to get a more consistent connection the quality wasn't that much better than rabbit ears and then you and then you saw the transition from cable tv to uh you know it's it's still cable delivered in a lot of scenarios but you've seen the the transition from black and white to color to high definition and now we're about to see uh, uh the 4k which is ultra hd ultra high definition So it's just a constant cycle. What we really have not seen yet is the evolution of how it's delivered. And and what I believe is that the internet, the way that we perceived the internet in the past is a way to go to a website. Now a lot of people don't even think about websites. They think about social media. And a lot of people don't even care about social media. They want video, in my opinion the internet delivered video is the future and i'm not just saying youtube i mean i'm on youtube right now youtube is awesome and i appreciate the opportunity that youtube provides content creators like myself and other entertainers too really cool tool but think in that think from that perspective where have where has technology been what may it morph into and if you can think about that this is just the example of television but think about other scenarios other products other services think about everything that you can and just look at it and be like let's just 
pull something random out, something I haven't even thought about. So you're driving down the road and you're looking at your GPS in your car. Maybe you've got a built-in GPS, I don't. But if you did, what would be the next evolution of GPS? That's something to ponder. There's stuff around everywhere. And if you just actively task yourself with analyzing it and saying what's next, you might be impressed with what you find. And you might not find anything. Because again, this video and all my videos are for entertainment purposes only. They should not be considered a recommendation to buy or sell secure. I'm providing this video for entertainment purposes only. But if you want to check out my book, <laughs> and I'm not trying to pump my book, but if you want to, you can find a link on youtube.com forward slash epic stock DD. And the picture of me in front of the bull on Broadway it says buy my book. You can check that out if you want to. If you don't want to, that's fine. Still enjoy my videos, still subscribe, share with others. That's my goal here. My goal here is to entertain and ultimately grow the footprint of youtube.com forward slash epic stock dd because i like to have a good time and i hope that you find my videos to be entertaining y'all have a good day